Case number 18009er. The reported victim is Mr. Johnny Hernandez of 77 Partition Street, Saugatees, New York. When Mr. Hernandez attempted to pour a bowl of his beloved morning cereal, the victim was startled by an unusual addition to the colorful mix. And I said, what about breakfast with toiletries? He said, I think I'll take me a rain check. That's not an FDA approved ingredient. Deuce police. Deuce police. Thank God you're here. Does that mean somebody dropped a deuce turd in my favorite breakfast cereal? Let's not jump to conclusions, Johnny boy. This could be the devious act of a disgruntled employee at the manufacturing facility. Or someone could be squatting the red eye over your cereal box. Well, it could also be. I hate to say it. There could be something bigger at hand here. It's fresh. Yo, that's crazy. Dudes running around here shitting people's cereal boxes. Let's not jump to conclusions, Charlie boy. Just police, Deacon. We have a smear campaign on our hands. We need to alert the media. We have a serial deucer on the loose. We interrupt this program. We interrupt this program. We interrupt this program with a special report. Our sources have just confirmed that there is a serial deucer. A serial deucer. A serial deucer at large. Authorities are calling him the son of Toucan Sam. Son of Toucan Sam. The son of Toucan Sam, and he is regarded as a major threat not only to America's cereal consumers, but to the economy as well. Cereal plants nationwide have shut down production indefinitely. And thousands of employees are left out of work. Last year, the total breakfast cereal sales were slightly over $13.3 billion in the U.S. alone. Cereal sales have now plummeted over the last two months, and the industry is reporting losses in the millions. Guys, 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 I honestly don't know if our industry can survive the son of Toucan Sam. If America wants its cereal industry back, the Deuce Police must apprehend son of Toucan Sam. Or we're going to need a government bailout, okay? That's it, fellas. What about this and what about that? Supermarkets nationwide have pulled all breakfast cereals off of their shelves, and television networks have dropped cereal related commercials from airing. This summer is now going down in history as the summer of Toucan Sam. The summer of Toucan Sam. As the summer of Toucan Sam.
far as the investigation goes, the Duke police do not seem to have any prime suspects in the search for the notorious son of Toucan Sam. September 20th at 1300 hours, B.O. Reeks and I were called to the residence of Joey De Palma in Newark, New Jersey. Mr. De Palma reported that he allegedly has video of the aforementioned suspect in his possession. Oh my god, the ghost police! I'm your biggest fan, Reeks! I'm growing a beard just like you! Leave the shit talking to us, JD. What do you got? Hold on, let me straighten up a little. So we got this video camera thing here. Had it here for years. Years! When I came home, this is what I saw. Huh? Huh? Excuse me one moment, please. I gotta take this. Ma, guess what? Guess who's here? The Deuce Police. They're here. No, ma, not the poopy patrol. The deuce police. They hit my. You know what, ma? I gotta go right now. All right, let me go. Listen, I'll call you back. Yeah. Can we focus, please? All right, bye. <laughs> I don't know if you guys know this, but I always wanted to be a member of the deuce police. I was even an honorary member, but your website said you're no longer taking applications. So they're no longer taking applications. Maybe you guys, maybe you guys know something, huh? Be it right. Do you smell what's going on in here? Listen, I'm all about, you know, the milk turning chocolate and all. I'm just as cuckoo for Cocoa Puffs as the next guy, but this is way west of chocolatey. Roll that around in your mouth. This just in, there has been surveillance footage that could possibly identify the son of Toucan Sam. Noticias de última hora. Nos han llegado unas imágenes que posiblemente podrían identificar a the son of Toucan Sam. The Deuce Police are in search for the unidentified man in this video. The Deuce Police está intentando identificar a la persona en este video. After the release of the video, News New York has received information of another smear campaign. What is this riddle? Two of Scoops Raisins. No, Raisins of Scoops. Two, two of, two of Raisins. Two of Raisins, we're on two, two. we're close, raisins we're close. Of two of scoops. Raisins. Raisin Bran, Raisin Bran. Two Scoops of Raisins! This now begs the question, why are the Deuce Police handling this investigation? ¿Por qué Deuce Police está a cargo de esta investigación? The son of two can Sam, yet on time seem may out of how high am I? Till I have Deuce Police Taipo. The Deuce Police Department is incapable of solving this crime. This is a situation for the FBI. The FBI, working in close conjunction with local law enforcement, will solve this case. Do we have any questions? God bless America, thank you. The summer of Toucan Sam. The summer of Toucan Sam. The summer that has affected the economy by the loss of thousands of jobs in America's cereal industry and cost the industry millions of dollars. The summer that has changed the way our children and grandchildren have their breakfast before school. This summer is in the hands of the Deuce Police. We now take you live to a press conference where Major Deegan is addressing the media. Major Deegan, Major Deegan, hey Major Deegan, there's a lot of serial deucers out there. What, what, what about B.O. Reeks? My fellow Americans, it is with great pleasure that I announce today that the suspect known 
as the son of Toucan Sam has been apprehended. Major Deegan! Before I take any Deegan. questions, allow me to recall the chain of events that led to Bow Officer Reeks and myself to arrest this vicious criminal. While investigating an alleged curbing of a canine violation of Article 122, Bow Officer Reeks and I approached the suspect in question. Ooh. Ooh. What a fine day to enjoy a couple of footfalls with some canines. Jeez. How are the pretty pups? Oh, they're great! And what are their names? Why, Snap, Crackle, and Whoop! Couldn't help but notice that steaming pile that one of your Rice Krispies delivered to that fresh cut grass over there. Violation of Article 122. Ooh, it's magically delicious! We're on to you. Don't try any tricks with us, Magic Man. Oh no, tricks are for kids! Okay. I got him! Get down! Stop! Shut up! Oh! Oh! Oh, alright. Okay, we got it. So go ahead, America. Enjoy your favorite breakfast treat once again. Indulge in big bowls of artificially flavored fruit rings. A crack coated shredded wheat. Enjoy them by the handful. Enjoy them by the bowl. Enjoy them by the box. Watch the children rejoice as we carry on this early morning tradition of Americana. The breakfast nooks are safe once again. Rejoice, young appetites. Rejoice. The summer of Toucan Sam is over. The fall of Toucan Sam has emerged. As the leaves turn, a new chapter has emerged in the history of American folklore. Gone are the days of George Washington and Thomas Jefferson, albeit cemented in history, but Wyatt Earp and J. Edgar Hoover and others in the past have inevitably made their mark on the history of the criminal justice system of America. But today breeds a new brand of hero. This year, from now on, will be always known as the Year of the Deuce Police. A stinky situation when you got a number two When you're stepping on the dirt It smears the bottom of your shoe When it's clogged up to the max Overflowing with the brew What you gonna do? Juice police Keeping your shit legit Yeah.